Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Building Spaceball City in Lego Worlds. I'm Dark Helmet Cat 67, and this is Mike. Mike says hi. So, it's it's been a while since I did since I did these videos. So, as you remember in the last in the last episode, we started to build this awesome school, and I did I did a bit of work off camera. I actually, excuse me, <coughs> excuse me again. Sorry about the cough. I had a cold a little while ago, so so. So anyway, as you remember in the last episode, we started to build the school. And I actually did a bit of work off camera. I actually made it a bit bigger. I added it by adding a few more classrooms. So I placed down the same model but just modified it. Like I removed the the red door except for this one cuz eventually the kids will need to get inside the school. So. Today we're gonna, we're gonna continue working on the school. We're gonna, we're gonna build a playground right now. Yes, so that way kids can come outside and and eat their lunch. Uh, I mean, wait, there's no cafeteria. <coughs> <coughs> that way kids can come outside and play on the playground, like during recess time. Which is the best time of the time of the school day, because you get to go outside, get some exercise. That's what I remembered about being in elementary school. Like going outside for recess, and just play on the playground. Yeah. So we're going to build a playground right here in our school. I know the school doesn't have a cafeteria, but we may make one. Don't worry. I may make a cafeteria, but we'll see where we could put that. Where we could put that cafeteria. We're gonna extend on here. I want to make this a little bit bigger. Because I will build. Cause I'm gonna build like a, <coughs> excuse me, cause we'll build like a basketball court. Not only not only during recess that the kids can play on the playground, they can also play like basketball or any other ball games, like dodgeball or something. So we're going to make this bigger. Don't worry. Now you may be thinking to yourself like that 
Like, is he building roads or something? No, don't worry. They're not roads. The stuff behind the school won't be a place where where cars could drive, no. Don't worry. We'll put we'll put the basketball court so that way cars will know not to not to travel in this space. Cuz that's a kids playing area. All right. One more like this. And let's fill in these. These missing spaces. There. And maybe we'll put like a door or something here. <clears throat> you know, so that way the kids can get picked up. The parents parents can come and pick up their children at the end of the day. Like a pickup area for cars. But don't worry. We're going to do that later. But today we're only focusing on the playground. Because I love playgrounds. Who doesn't love playgrounds? I love the swings. Don't you, Mike? I think he does. I think Mike loves playing on the playground. Okay. The way we could do this, we got two ways how we could do this. <clears throat> uh, let's use the replace tool. Let's replace the grass with something that could be like for mulch. What could be used for mulch? Do I have mud? Red sand, darker red sand, dark red sand, sandstone, oh, candy floss. I mean, if we want, we could just leave it as, like, we could just leave it with, we could just put it on the grass. Squeaky floor? Ooh. Did you know there's a material called squeaky floor? We I never used that one. Maybe we'll use it somewhere. Granite? Hmm. What could we use for the mulch? You know, like the mulch that you see at in the school playground? Where the playground equipment is on? You know what I'm talking about. Is there anything that's closest to it? I don't see, like, mulch or anything close to it. We could just use dirt, dirty rust, rusty dirt, or rust sand. How about rusty sand? That sounds like a good color. Let's see what that looks like. Yeah. That could be perfect. Oh, that's perfect. Where they get that? Let's fill in these. Let's fill in the outline right here. How big are we gonna make this playground? I want it to be quite big.
I don't want it to be too big, so. Almost. There we go. There we go. And now we can fill in the fill in this whole thing inside of it. We made a perimeter around it so that we don't overflow with the the material. And then we're going to put all the playground equipment inside that rusty sand. That's closest to mulch, I think. Yeah. There we go. Good work, Mike. All right, now we just have this final square to fill in. There we go. Mike, this is looking pretty good. I like it. Let's spin the sky. <clears throat> and let's get some playground equipment in. I think it's a discovery. Street parks. Because obviously this is a playground. Let's get the slide. Let's put the slide in. And also we need to make that kind of uh, uh what's that thing called we like go inside and you like like all these obstacles. Is that a jungle gym? I think that's a jungle gym. Now, I'm sorry that my my voice may sound a bit funny because, like I said, I had a cold a little while ago. So, I may sound a little funny. So, so I just wanted to make sure that, that you're fine with that. That I may sound funny because... I was sick a little while ago. So, I haven't done a lot of... I haven't done a video oh, forever ago. <clears throat> yeah. Alright, so let's put the slide... Where should we put the slide, Mike? Where's a good place for a slide? Mm. Let's put a slide right here. Yeah. All right, let's get the swing. Let's get the little swing set. Let's put them right next to each other, because that's how it is at a at a real playground. They're connected. I think we'll have room for one more. Oh yeah, we that's enough. Oh yeah. <clears throat> Uh, let's leave. let's just leave it like this. Don't worry. We can always extend it. Don't worry. 
uh, I wish there was more playground equipment rather than just the slide, the swing, and these kind of little springy rides, like duck, duck ride and the rocket ride. Oh, and even the round, the roundabout. Yeah, we got to put that. There we go, got the roundabout. And let's get the springy rise. Let's start with the rocket ride. Let's put this guy, let's put him, put the rocket spring ride right here. And then we'll get the duck spring ride and put it on the opposite side. There we go. Looks pretty nice, I love it. I'm loving it. Just like the slogan from McDonald's. Ba 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 ba. I'm loving it. Hmm. I wish there was more other playground equipment. I wish there was a jungle gym prop. Hmm. Wait, um, didn't I save? <clears throat> didn't I save a few couple of, couple of playground equipment I made myself? Like a sandbox or something? We should put a sandbox in this playground. I, I know it's, I know I have it. There it is. There's the sandbox. I did have it. Let's put the sandbox. Let's put the sandbox. Right. Right here. That's like a good spot for it. All right, so we, now that not only kids can play on the slide, the swings, the roundabout, and the spring rides, they could also play in the sandbox. So we gotta, I mean, let's extend more on this. Let's make it a little bigger. Let's see why not. Because maybe we might build like a the little jungle gym or whatever, whatever that thing is that you like go inside. The, and there, there are slides attached to that, so. Yeah. go there's the hmm all right we got the uh, got most of the playground equipment in. Mike, this looks pretty nice. Let's have Mike go on the swing. Pick a swing, any swing. Let's take the middle one. I'm trying to see if the chain is more sturdy enough to handle some weight. I think it. I think it's sturdy enough. <clears throat> yeah. So that way the chain doesn't snap when the when the kid is swinging on the swing. We don't want anyone to be getting hurt during the school day. I mean, there's all w w there's not even a nurse's office in there. Yeah. 
Uh, we may have to eventually find a. Sp we may have actually have to extend the school out a bit. Because I want to, uh, to build these. Um, Ah, whatever. There's always... I mean, there's always a first aid kit in the hallway. We'll pretend there's a first aid kit in the hallway. That way, if anyone does get hurt throughout the school day, then they could go get a bandage, get some first aid. I mean, or if a kid is not feeling good or, or got sick... And needs to go home sick. The teacher can just call. The teacher can just call their parents. Have the kid talk to them. And that way they could come pick them up. Let's have Mike go down the slide. Whee. Oh that was fun. Okay the slide was sturdy enough too. We want everything to be sturdy enough. That way it can handle some weight. That way it doesn't collapse or break. And nobody gets injured. During recess. No. We don't want that. We want our kids to have fun at recess time. Let's also build a... A court. A basketball court. We'll, we'll put a spot in here to build a basketball court. Oh. Let's put lines. We'll put lines in the in the road. Like we could do like yellow lines. Yes. We'll make like a square or something. And we'll put slashes in there. Those of you wondering what that kind of thing is on the road. What that symbol is on the road. A yellow square with slashes inside. I think you all know what that means. But if not, if you're new, if you don't know what that means, that means cars cannot drive there. So. Cars are not allowed to travel in that spot. In a, in a spot where there's a, a yellow square or, or a huge square with slashes in. But I'll, I'll probably do that off camera. Don't worry. Because I don't want... I don't want this video to be going too long. I want to get this under 30 minutes. Let's see how many minutes... 23 minutes. Because <clears throat> I don't want this video to be too long. The last video was actually pretty good. It was actually 30 minutes, or I think it was under that. I think it was under 30 minutes, so we made good timing. I may build that piece of playground equipment like a jungle gym or something, where you could like jump on the, with like so many like steel platforms. Oh, we need to make monkey bars. We need to put the monkey bars. That's another piece of playground equipment. Monkey bars. I love the monkey bars. That was actually pretty fun. Let's actually quickly build that. Do I have a... Do I have... Do I have something that I could use? 
ladder. Do I have any ladders that I... Let me try typing in ladder. Ladder. It's spelled with, spelled with two Ds. I got this pool ladder. Swimming pool ladder? No. No, I have I have to at least have like a I need a regular ladder, not a swimming pool ladder. Hey, let me place this down for you. You know what I'm talking about? A Pugsy platform. Okay. This kind of ladder. The one that I made for Pugsy? To climb down off the platform? Huh. Maybe I could convert this into a piece of playground equipment. Why not? I'm trying to figure out how I could convert. Maybe I want to convert this into a piece of playground equipment. But I need to figure out how I should do that. I should plan out my ideas of how I want to do that. Convert this into a piece of playground equipment. Like a little jungle gym or something. But this is the ladder I want to use for... You know. I think I may eventually, like, copy and save the ladder. I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna save this as a model. Or maybe just a temporary save. Well, there, there we go. Got it. Let's see. How many? It's kind of hard to see with all the bricks. I just make the copy thing. Oh wait, I can do this. And just delete all this, but titanium metallic, or is that platinum? Yeah. Then all we would do is recopy it again without the thing and place it down in the in the ground. Yeah, there we go. We're going to make this pretty huge monkey bars. There we go, just like that. Don't wait, we'll, we'll carve out some of this. And we're going to carve this out, make it shorter. Because obviously, it's monkey bars wouldn't be too tall. If you think about it. Uh, let's see. Monkey bars are usually like. Three steps high. Off the ground. I think. 
Wait. Oh. Hmm. Nope. Let's make it this high. Yes. Because I want... I don't want to, to make it too high. Not too high. And not too low. Then we can just replace this. Let's replace the copper metallic with the platinum metallic. And get rid of that. There we go. Now this changed the bricks a bit, but that's fine. Get out. <clears throat> there was a message thing that just popped up and I had to I had to exit it out. But don't worry, I don't think you wouldn't see it as you're watching it. From like Norton or something. Alright, let's now we're gonna build it. This will be the last piece of playground equipment that we're gonna pl that we're gonna place. Let's use the uh, 1 by 12. Wait, uh. <laughs> Did I just remove that another? Oh, we'll see. And then we're going to take the 1 by 8 flat tile and place right here. Let's connect it. Oh, wait. Dang. Wait, uh. Yeah. We can just remove all of these. And that. And we're gonna remove that. For this part, we're gonna need to use the remove tool. Because it's a one by one, or it's a one by two. And delete that. And now we need to put in the bars, the metal bars for our monkey bars. Let's use the one by two tile. For the bars. Hold on. Let's make it thicker. Yeah, like that. Okay. This is a good space. I like it when you see like a a square, a square hole in between. That's a good length. I like it. Now it's gonna be more challenging. Make the most challenging monkey bars ever. All right, let's put these metal things on top and. And we're done. There's our monkey bars. Our monkey bars are all ready. 
Except that one's a bit off. It may be a bit off, but that's fine. I kind of don't mind that. Well, we have our monkey bars. All right. All right, before we end this episode, I'm just going to delete this. That was just temporary. I may eventually try to figure out how to convert this into a piece of playground equipment. But like I said, I'll need to take some time to sketch out my ideas that I want to incorporate. So, I that's going to have to be like some other episode where we do that. But there's plenty of more to there's plenty of more stuff to do in the school building process. But that's going to have to be it for this episode right now. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to leave a comment, smash that like button if you like it, and um I'll see you guys in the next episode where we continue building our school. See you then. Bye-bye.